Hey, tubers. We're just uh, checking out the condition of the box here. I, uh, pulling things apart. Look at the dirt in there, eh? But, uh, oh, 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 what's that? What's that doing over there? Yeah, yeah, the box is off. Took her off today. <clears throat> I don't know how well you can see under there, but look at that filth, man. Thing doesn't look like it's been washed in many, 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 many years. <sighs> there you go. Have a look at that. Uh, I just thought I'd, uh, show you what I was doing today. I got bored, needed something to do, so I decided I'd uh, gain myself some access to the gas tank leak. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? But yeah, she's leaking right under there. Let's see if I can get... Uh, I don't know how well you can see that, but there's like a little foam pad in there, and underneath that foam pad is just pure rust been uh, growing for a long time apparently. Uh, I think I've told a few of you guys about the exhaust on this thing too. Look at this. Not even welded. And then this, this, whatever it is. And then this. Like, look at the, look at the, the, the cockeyedness of this shit. And then Right here, yeah, you can see that's that's open. And they're right there in front of the muffler. You can see where I've had to tape it because there was another opening in the welds. And then further up at the uh, at the cat before it, there's another one. And then on the other side of the cat, there's another one. And then uh, you look down here. The exhaust is really close there. You can see she's. Uh, She's been rubbing the vent tube a little bit when the suspension flexes. So anyway, uh, this isn't really a how-to, it's more of an overview of what's going to happen here. Um, you're going to have three Torx bolts holding this in. One there, one there, one there. That's all you need to remove, and then you can just push that aside. There's a ground strap, 10 millimeter bolt. There'll be a bolt in this hole, same over there, both 18 mils. There'll be one right here, accessible down there through a hole in the frame, right beside the gas tank, 18 mil, another 18 mil. Same deal with all these ones in the frames, guys, there's holes underneath, you can access them straight through with an extension. Uh, impact is your friend here, they're all 18 mil bolts. Except for this one, that's a 10 mil, and these are torques, like I said. Uh, and then it's just a matter of lifting it off. Uh, you don't have to remove the bumper to do it. The uh, the hole is still a oh, chunk of rust there. The hole's still accessible to get to the bolt, so you don't actually have to remove the bumper. And then uh, with the light wiring, it's just simply a matter of you undo the tail lights. You can pull the wires down and out of the uh, the light pockets in the bed, and then it's just a bunch of clips across the bottom of the bed. Uh, I'll show you that in a couple of seconds. And then, uh, yeah, as you can see, I just kind of wrapped around the bumper to get them out of the way. But anyway, it's just a, uh, a quick overview of, of what's going on here. Um, but yeah, as you can see, if you look there, you can see the stains on the tank directly under this cross member so by process of elimination there's the leak but yeah the whole tank looks like hell anyway sending in it looks like hell so whatever just change your all I guess eh? anyway we'll uh, come back in a second and I'll show you where those clips are for the wires and and uh, we'll go and post this up okay, so here we are at the back of the truck the uh, grimy old light buckets Anyway, the wires run in through there. You just pull the wires down and out through the bottom here. 
and then up inside that channel is where your wires run and there's just a bunch of little clips in there that hold them just undo those little clips pull your wires out dangle them free in behind your truck or wrap them around the bumper like I did keep them out of the way uh, it's pretty much just a matter of preference anyway there you go enjoy <laughs>